Hi everyone! Welcome back to my garden and today we're going to be reading a book that I wrote and illustrated called Dear Teacher which is inspired by a group of fantastic teachers in the second language acquisitioning class. So let's read it! Dear Teacher, written and illustrated by Ana C. Peñalosa. This book is dedicated to the second language acquisitioning class. You are the best group of teachers that I know. Marcella was looking outside of her, win her living room window. She missed her friends at school. She missed her teachers. Ever since the pandemic started, life had changed a lot. As she pet her dog Sammy and thought about how bored she was, she saw Mrs. Reba walking her dog Moy outside. She wished she could pet Moy like old times. All of a sudden, Marcella had an idea. She got ready in less than five minutes. I'm ready! Marcella ran to the kitchen table. Her mom was busy working. Marcella's mom, Miss Anna, was getting a report ready to present to her fellow teachers. Marcella took out all of her colors and started to paint. Mom, asked Marcella, can you help me with something? I want to make a surprise for my teachers. Miss Anna was so busy, she was on the verge of a breakdown. However, Marcella's mom loved her very much. She decided to take a break, pour herself some coffee, and see what Marcella was working on. She gave Marcella some milk. Marcella wanted to write letters to her teachers. Her mom helped write the opening to each one. Marcella tried to remember what made each one of her teachers special. Dear Teacher Vladimir, thank you for always helping me understand. Cher Professor Carmen, merci pour être toujours prête et à mes côtés. Dear Teacher Angie, thank you for understanding how I feel in class. Dear Teacher Paula, thank you for being kind, friendly, and funny. Dear Teacher Benjamin, thank you for teaching me something new every day. Dear Teacher Jimena, thank you for being my role model. Dear Teacher Magda, thank you for helping me appreciate the little things. Dear Teacher Andrea, thank you for being a true friend. Cher Professor Laura, merci pour être gentil et lire le meilleur livre. Dear Professor Liliana, thank you for your true love. You helped me love myself. Dear Teacher Sonia, thank you for inspiring me and teaching me so much. Dear Teacher Luz Andrea, thank you for sharing your knowledge and lighting the way. Dear Teacher Lisette, thank you for your beautiful smile and warm heart. Dear Teacher Alejandra, thank you for being so creative and taking care of us. Dear Teacher Nidith, thank you for empowering me to move forward. Dear Teacher Franklin, thank you for making me into a better person. Dear Teacher Jose, thank you for allowing me to discover new adventures. Dear Teacher Juliet, thank you for always listening to me. Dear Teacher Adriana, thank you for being such a hard worker and inspiration. Dear Teacher Catherine, thank you for your warmth, stories, and strength. Marcella finished all of her letters. It was already 10 p.m. Marcella was ready for bed, but she remembered she still had two more letters to write. The next morning, Marcella's mom and dad found a surprise under their pillows, too. Marcella was still sleeping, so her mom got ready and sent the letters in the mail. 
Marcella woke up late in the afternoon. She sat by the window to see who she could spot walking by. Who should show up but Mrs. Reba, who waved at Marcella with a huge smile on her face. Marcella waved back and figured she had gotten her letter. The End So I hope you like this book and I hope it inspires you to write your teachers a message, a letter, or give them a phone call and tell them how much you appreciate everything that they do for you. Until next time, bye!